Okay, one of the more popular comments I've been getting on my digging a 40 foot well video is, can you drink the water? And the answer has been, I have no idea. But today I got a water test in the mail that I'm gonna do and see what all is in my well water. All right, the time has come. I'm gonna finally test my well water and see what is in here and see if by some miracle that I can drink this stuff. Okay, step one is the bacterial test. It says uh, fill this little vial with water and shake it up, which I did. It's purple right now. And it says, let this sit here for 48 hours. So that's what I'm gonna do. I will come back and look at this in two days. If it's still purple, then we're good. If it turns yellow, then it's not good. Okay, some of the other tests are like little strips like this. This is the copper test. So it just says, immerse this in water for 30 seconds. And, uh, oh, it says I should be waving this back and forth in the sample. And basically how dark it is determines how much copper is in the water. And then we put that here. Then we'll do iron, nitrate, and pH hardness slash chlorine test. This is the lead test. I got exactly seven drops of water, put it in this vial, and I put this strip in, the arrows pointing down, which they are. Uh, I think I let it sit there. I let it sit there for 10 minutes. Okay, for all the tests on this side, we have some results. <clears throat> uh, doesn't look like there's much copper at all. There's a little bit of iron. There's actually less iron than I thought there would be. On pH, the, the amount of chlor chlorine, the amount of chlorine is pretty low. Hardness looks like right in the middle between 120 and 250. The pH looks really high. This is either 8.5 or 10 based on this color scale. And for uh, nitrates, pretty close to zero or on the low side in terms of this scale here. Okay, we're now at 10 minutes on the lead test. So I take this strip out I point the arrows to the left and I want the left line to be darker than the right line and it definitely is so that means we are negative for lead all right we're two days later this thing has not moved and it is purple the results are in, purple is good. This test did not uh, find any of the bacteria that this test is testing for. So, uh, good news all around. Well, I'm not sure what all this means, but the water looks pretty clear. Actually, it doesn't taste that bad.